lot of people here. It's awesome. It's awesome. Uh, knock out a few thank yous here real quick. Uh, my staff. Uh, I have been running around. I feel like I've been here, there, and everywhere the last couple of weeks. Uh, I'm not going to single anybody out. I'm just going to say every one of you, you rock. Absolutely love what we're doing with our department, our culture. Uh, just everybody on that staff, thank you, thank you, thank you for everything that you've done through this process. Uh, Dr. Schatzel, thank you so much. Your counsel, your support, your guidance to this search, it means a lot. Abby, Gus, and Hadley, thank you. You guys do a lot for me. Keep me centered. And at the end of the day, I know that everything's going to be okay. So thank you. Anyone who offered support and guidance? There was a lot of you. <laughs> thank you. I headed into this search under the idea that this process was going to be exactly that, a search. I wasn't focused on targeting, targeting a few names because of their win-loss record. I wasn't focused on finding someone who would win the press conference. I was focused on having as many conversations as possible in order to find the right leader for this program. I was focused on finding someone who would fit this university and this city. I was focused on finding someone who would put the work in to win games and build this program back to greatness. I wanted to find a coach who understood what it meant to build a program. Over 12 years as a head coach, Pat Kelsey has built two of them, Winthrop and the College of Charleston, both great institutions, but hard places to build sustained success. 11 regular season and conference championships at those places. I wanted to find a leader who understood and could, and could adapt to the changing landscape in college athletics. College of Charleston has one of, one of the more well-resourced resourced NIL programs outside of the Power Six. I asked Pat how he was going to adapt to the various rule changes that are undoubtedly coming to college athletics. His answer was simple. We're going to tackle it the same way we tackled NIL. We're going to run towards it. Pat and his staff are going to be prepared for whatever the future holds. I wanted someone who could communicate and connect with the fans. That's this guy. Pat Kelsey understands that fans are the lifeblood of a successful, sustained program. He understands that while stacking wins is important, it's also important for the fans to feel connected to this program. I wanted someone who has the ability to navigate all of the responsibilities outside of coaching his team that this job demands. This job is big. This job is hard. It demands a lot. This job will impact your family. You have to know that from the first day you take this job, there is never a day off. There is no, yesterday didn't go well and no one noticed. If you're willing to embrace that and you're prepared to navigate that, this is one of the best jobs in the world. Pat is prepared to navigate and manage all that comes with this job. I had to have someone with an endless amount of energy someone with a passion for what they do. Pat texted me yesterday, give me the name of three people I, needed, I need to reach out to today. I think I gave him eight. He texted back, said done. We were discussing the roster and the, and the transfer portal last night at about midnight. I had a text waiting for me this morning at 5.30. Passion, energy, intensity, box has been checked. I wanted someone who was organized, detail-oriented, and understands the complexities of managing a group of staff and student athletes. As I asked around, it was evident Pat knows exactly what he wants from each of his staff members. Staff, his staff will understand the expectations of this program. The student athletes in this program will represent U of L with class and humility. Everyone in his organization will be held accountable. I wanted a guy who develops a culture of winning. Culture wins in business, in sports, culture wins. Every day, everyone in your organization creates your culture by what they value, believe, think, say, and do. Pat studies culture, he studies leadership, he studies great organizations. Pat's pursuit of an exceptional culture is endless. Pat fits the culture of this athletic department. I wanted a coach 
whose core values reflected the core values of our president and my leadership. A coach who refuses to compromise when it comes to integrity, honesty, hard work, and treating people the right way. A coach who no matter what the situation, I know he will make the right decision. That is Pat Kelsey. Lastly, I wanted a winner. This guy sitting up here is a winner in everything that he does. The conversations I had with coaches, ADs, conference commissioners, there was a consistent theme. Pat Kelsey is a winner, plain and simple. This search took longer than people wanted it to. I understand that. But I was not going to compromise on any of those traits I've just discussed. This hire means too much to say this, is, this guy's pretty good, but... I don't have to say that about Pat Kelsey. We found the absolute best guy for the job. Johnny, Ruthie, Caroline, Lisa, welcome to Louisville. We're so excited for you to be part of the Cardinal family. And Pat, it's an honor to introduce you as the head coach of the Louisville men's basketball program.